Hey everyone, in this video I have a really cool DVD box set to show you guys. This is Nickelodeon's All Grown Up The Collector's Set. And the first thing you may be wondering is, wait a minute, this was never released. Um, well, not in the United States anyways, this is actually the Australian version, which I picked up on Amazon, the United States Amazon, from a third-party seller. I think their uh, seller name is like Prime DVDs or something. So it was 50 bucks and free shipping and all that with uh, Amazon Prime. And I thought, you know, that's actually a pretty reasonable deal. And it says on the website, on, a on the Amazon page, that this is actually a region-free set. So hopefully it is. Hopefully it's not like region 4 or whatever the Australian region is. Uh, otherwise I'd probably have to send it back. But it said, it, it said it's region, region free, therefore it should work in the United States players, uh, DVD players just fine. And uh, the sellers seemed fairly reputable. They seemed, you know, pretty legitimate. And looking at this box set, it looks legitimate to me. Um, but yeah, this is my very first ever uh, purchase of a, you know, an imported DVD or a, a DVD that's not region one, I guess. So yeah, and they for some reason haven't released All Grown Up in the United States on DVD, you know, they even on Amazon Burn On Demand, haven't seen anything. Uh, all we've seen is the compilation discs, which there are several of those, uh, with just a few episodes, but not any season sets or complete series sets or anything like that. So, um, I just, you know, decided what the heck, I'm going to go ahead and uh, go ahead and import this. Well, actually, it really wasn't an import for me, but somebody must have imported it as it is an Australian release. But here's what the front cover looks looks like here. It's a, it's a nice box set. The only thing that I can definitely tell right off the bat is I don't like the style of it, uh, at least how you get at the discs from the inside. It looks like you either have to pull the cover off the top or the bottom. It doesn't have them uh, like on the side where you can just slide them out and access them that way. You have to either open them up, uh, get them from the top or the bottom it looks like, which is, you know, it's it's just that that's how you're gonna get, you know, additional wear on the slip cover. So I'll probably just, you know, open up the bottom and get the discs, discs out of there. But, you know, whatever. Other than that, it's a very nice looking slip box here. It's nice and colorful. It's It's a little bit simple. The background is pretty simple, you know, blue background and everything. But it looks nice. And you know, like the, the Nickelodeon logo and everything, it, it matches up well with the style that they're doing with the United States releases as well, for the most part. So, so that's quite nice. The only little things that aren't going to match are like you know this general, uh, you know general audiences, whatever. How the, you know how they do that in Australia, and it's released by a company called Beyond Home Entertainment, which you know I'm sure that's an Australian company. Um, I did get this with just a little bit of damage here and there, like, you know, crushed corners, things like that, but I'm not, it said there was only one left in stock, and, you know, essentially what this is for me is like a placeholder um, until, you know, hopefully Paramount or Shout Factory or Amazon Burn On Demand or, you know, whoever uh, releases this officially in the United States, then I would pick those up for sure because, you know, generally I just prefer to have the United States releases. Um, just makes more sense to me being in the United States. But, um, you know, before that happens, if it ever happens, maybe it'll never happen, you know, this, this is going to be like my placeholder set or whatever. So, here's a look at the back. Uh, just has a little description of what's included in here. It has seasons one through five of All Grown Up, which is the entire series. It includes all 55 episodes from seasons one through five. So there are four. Uh, it looks like there's going to be four DVD sets included in here. The first and second seasons, and then three, four, and five. And you can see all the characters there on the bottom. So overall, pretty nice box. It's just going to be interesting to see how I open this up. But uh, here's a look at the bottom as well. It has this... Uh, sticker placed over the plastic wrap, which is probably something that the seller did. Uh, there's some more information on the bottom. We'll go ahead and open this up and uh, take a closer look at that. Alright, so now that the plastic wrap is off, we'll take a closer look at the bottom here. And like I said, that. This, this set that I got does have a little bit of damage. It's got the crushed corners in that. So, you know, it, it is what it is. It's It doesn't bother me too much because, like I said, this is, 
you know, I never really thought I would purchase this, but it was just kind of something I'm like, you know, it'd be cool to have all grown up, and they haven't released it in the States, so this is, like I said, going to be kind of a placeholder until they maybe actually release it someday, but duration, over 22 hours, uh, copyright is 2018, so this must be a fairly recent release, uh, maybe even, you know, well, this year, or at least uh, maybe the late part of last year, I don't really know, but nick.com.au, the Australian Nickelodeon website, and uh, yeah, that's basically all there is on the bottom here. So I think I'm going to try and get at these discs from the bottom, and you can see it, it's, this is why, you see, I, I already wrinkled this a little bit trying to open this up, and that's just kind of part of the wear that you're going to have when you have a box set like this, so I uh, definitely wanted to go at this from the bottom rather than the top. The top looks nicer, and the bottom's going to get more wear from being on the shelf anyways, so may as well do that, but... But anyways, here is what's included inside, and I was kind of expecting that these would be individually wrapped. They are not, but that doesn't really matter to me. So, uh, we'll take a look at these. We have, first of all, Seasons 1 and 2. Here is the front cover. Pretty nice artwork on these. Here's a look at the spine. And you know, I suppose if you're someone who doesn't really care about slipcovers, you could just, you know, toss it, but that's, of course, I'm, I have to, you know, keep everything complete, so uh, I will be keeping that. But here's a, here's a look at the back, has a description, includes all episodes from seasons one and two. Uh, more basic description stuff on the bottom, 25 episodes plus bonus, it says in here. Don't know what the bonus features are going to be, um, but if we look inside, uh, we have Season 1, Disc 1 right here, and we'll take a look at the back. Looks like a, you know, legit press disc to me, although I will say that these cases, I don't know, these kind of seem like sort of kind of cheap cases, I don't know. You know, given that I did buy this from a third-party seller on Amazon, I suppose there is a slight possibility that these could be bootlegs. You know, there's there's always that risk when you're buying online from eBay or Amazon third parties or anything like that. Uh, but they do look legitimate overall, and like I said, it, <laughs> these are not released in the United States, so it's, you know, it, there's no really other way to get these, I guess. Uh, but here is Season 2 right here. Uh, disc 1 and Disc 2. So pretty nice artwork on these and that takes care of the first set there and then we'll take a look at Season 3 up next. So it's kind of purple background. And there is that. This one appears to be a two disc set. Basic, basically the same artwork style. Pretty nice. It's got thumbnails, uh, description, and then information on the bottom here open this up and we just have uh, two discs inside. There's disc one and disc number two. Pop one out just to show you the bottom. Uh, let's see, and then the next one we have is season four right here. There is the spine and there is the back. And let's see, yeah, everything else pretty much the same, so we'll take a look at the discs. There's disc one, disc two, and the last one here is season five, so here's a look at the front artwork and the spine. And then here is a look at the back. So, now one thing that I am noticing here is if we take a look here, I didn't notice this on the back of the slip box, but you see that 4 there, region 4? Now that does very much worry me that these may not work in my United States player, despite being advertised that they would as such on Amazon's uh, product description, unless maybe I read it wrong. I don't know. We're gonna have to see, I guess. So I'll definitely try these out on my DVD player before ending this video. I'll just do a little cut and tell you guys if these actually work or not. 
Um, but here is disc one of season five and disc two. And yeah, it'll be very disappointing if these don't work, but I, you know, maybe I can send them back then or something. But, or I could just get a, you know, region free DVD player and start collecting a bunch of uh, imported titles. Who knows? But anyway, here's a look at the complete series of All Grown Up, the Australian release. Um, now let's uh, see if these actually work on an American player. All right, so I just got done testing the first disc in this set and then the last disc in season five, just kind of random, but uh, I tried them both on my PlayStation 3 and you know what? They played just fine. So despite these being region four, you know, they seem to play at least in my PlayStation 3 without any issues. I would assume they should play fine in any other DVD player as well. Um, so yeah, I you know, that's pretty cool that this is an option that you can get in the United States for this, um, you know, this series that hasn't seen an official United States release for whatever reason, so, and maybe it's still yet to come, maybe Paramount or Shout Factory or Amazon will uh, release this more officially in the United States, we'll just have to wait and see, I guess, but, but at least for now, you can go on Amazon and uh, search for this, search for this item, or each of these sets individually. They have these individually I've seen as well. I think I saw this one for like ten dollars on there and then the remaining three for about fifteen dollars so that comes out to about you know fifty five dollars I guess if you were to buy these individually if, the, if those prices are the same uh, as they were approximately when I'm making this video but uh, otherwise they do have uh, this collector set which includes all four for about fifty dollars which you know, you save about five dollars or whatever the price is whenever you're shopping, uh, and you get the, and you get the slip box as kind of a uh, bonus. You can think of it that way. So, so that's pretty cool. Um, really nice Australian release. It's good to see that they got some good releases going over there. And I did do a little bit of research on this uh, this company called uh, what are they called? Beyond Home Entertainment over there in Australia. It looks like they do have a lot of other good Nickelodeon stuff released there, like Rugrats. I think they have a complete series box set of the Rugrats as well as the seasons released individually and I think they have a lot of other shows as well but I, ha I haven't seen any of the other releases besides this one on Amazon uh, just from doing some quick searching maybe if, you, if uh, you're interested and you want to research that further you can find some of their other sets and import them here uh, if you don't like the United States stuff because apparently they work in the United States players. Um, but again, um, there is the possibility that, you know, I, I did buy these from a third-party seller on Amazon. It's, they were called Prime DVDs, and it, there is the possibility that these could be bootlegs. I, I don't really know. It looks like it's legitimate, though. It really looks, uh, it looks authentic to me. It seems authentic. Um, so, you know, good option, but, you know, there's always the possibility that, that these are bootleg because they do say that they are region 4 but they work in United States players and I would expect them to not work being region 4 but you know but they play just fine in my player so and you know they look clear and everything and everything looks good so uh, that's some good news there now I am curious if uh, you know if I have any Australian viewers watching my channel and if you've ever seen this set over there in Australia or maybe you own these sets individually or this box set if you if if you wouldn't mind leaving a comment and just saying if you see any differences or if they look about the same to you uh, I would you know I'm just kind of curious about that to see if you know just for comparison wise to you know if, if there are any differences then that would raise my suspicions on the authenticity of these but but like I said these do seem these seem uh, perfectly authentic to me from what I can tell anyways not that I'm any expert but uh, they, they seem pretty authentic so so, so far from what I can tell, this is a good way to get all grown up in the United States if, you're, if you've been on the hunt for the complete series, because obviously there's no official United States release. You can go on Amazon and just, you know, see if you can find this uh, all grown up collector set, this Australian release. And from my experience, they play in the United States players just fine. So that's an option if you've been looking for this. So hope you guys enjoyed this video. And uh, like I said... Overall, nice box set. I just don't really like this uh, the the box set style itself, where you kind of have to come at the discs from the top or the bottom. But other than that, pretty nice. And uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video, and we'll see you in the next video.